Well, hey there, all you property preservation maniacs. How's it going? Chuck Taylor with the Taylor Shop coming at you again with another vlog. Uh, this week's vlog, we're going to talk about PCRs, property condition reports. Should you fill them out? Yes. Do you fill them out? Probably not. And that's a problem. Um, I have to be honest, you know, probably about once a month I get a call from a guy who says, Chuck, man, I got, you know, 40, 50 work orders. They're all completed. No PCRs. Got photos. They're all due in a couple days or they're late. Uh, my girl just quit. Can you update them? You know, and I tell them all the same thing. Well, I could, but I'm not going to. And here's why. That's a big pile of mess. You know, having a bunch of orders with no PCRs. You know, it would be irresponsible of me as, you know, as a business owner to take on something like that and effectively compromise my resources I have here for processing work orders to throw that humongous monkey wrench into my finely oiled uh, machine here. Um, yeah, so, you know, it's imperative that guys in the field are filling out PCRs. It's just that simple. I mean, there's, you know, there's no two ways around it. If you're going to try to do, uh, you know, we're just talking about processing here. We're not, let's not talk about work orders in the field. Let's just talk about processing. If you're going to truly process work orders efficiently and accurately and, and at any level of volume, you know, and I'm not talking two, three orders a day. I'm talking 30, 40, 50, 100 orders a day. You must have documentation to go along with the photos. It's it's imperative. Now I've been in the field. I know what it's like. You know, I when I was in the field, it was it was me and my wife, and that was it. You know, for the most part, and you know, certainly on initials, and you know, uh, you just got to figure it out, figure out how to get it. You want to document everything because yes, as we are QC in the photos and going through the photos, and we catch tremendous amount of stuff. Guys, don't report. So, you know, our rule here is if it's on the PCR, it makes it into the update. Uh, anything beyond that is stuff that we'll catch and we'll take the initiative and bid. And we save contractors hundreds of thousands of dollars a year in potential misbids and chargebacks purely on the stuff that we catch in the photos alone. So that's with a PCR filled out. You know, guys can still miss things, you know, and our, you know, of course, our rule is if it's in the PCR, it makes it into the order. But it's imperative that, guys, there's so many subtle details that need to be reported on a property that need to be accurate. You know, was the hot water tank or furnace or air conditioner missing? You know, was it ever present? Um, you know, is the water off at the curb or the house? You know, which is it? You know, of course, if it's off at the curb, that's great. But if it's only off at the house and it's reported as it's off at the curb, um, and you know a pipe breaks and the place floods that's a problem um, and that's you know that's because of missing misreporting so you don't want that to happen I mean we push guys using forms because it's imperative to you know to you provide the information you're at the property you know what's going on it, you know we don't assume anything here this is not and I've said it a million times this is not an assumption business um, you know, the two biggest things is not an assumption business and mistakes cost money. And if you've been in this business for any length of time, you already know that. So it's imperative that you guys in the field are filling out PCRs and damage reports. Um, and well, do you know anybody that has a simple one page PCR, one page damage report that is super easy to fill out, that has been digitally converted as well as the ability to yeah, handwrite, fill, you know, pen to paper, fill it out and, and, uh, and, and take a photo and submit it. Do you know anybody that has that? I do. It's the tailor shop. That's right. We have our own proprietary, uh, you know, in-house customized uh, one-page PCR, one-page damage report that we provide to any and all contractors that are under contract with us. This isn't for just anybody out there. I'm just not giving this away. But any guy that's under contract with us gets access to these uh, forms. And let me tell you, they're wonderful forms. They're good. Yeah. No, I'm just kidding. Well, no, they are good. I'm just I'm getting a little weird here. Um, they're wonderful PCR forms. They're they're comprehensive and they're concise and they get right to the point. And quite frankly, if your guy in the field can pretty much circle and make a few notes, uh, he can fill it out. And it's very easy. And again, one page PCR, one page damage report. It does not get any easier than that. Oh, and did I say that they're digitally converted exclusively on PPW? 
Yeah, that's right. So if your guy is technically proficient, he'll be able to fill them out in the field. How wonderful is that? And then they come over to us and they look beautiful because they're digitally converted. That's wonderful. And they don't look like, well, you know, most guys, i got to be honest, most guys fill out the forms correctly and they are legible. Every now and then you get one that looks like it was written by a three-year-old. But that's just because the guy's probably in a hurry. And I get it. But it needs to be legible. You know, um, but we've been able in, in doing this over 10 years. Believe me, we read and write contractor very well. It's like doctor signatures and doctor writing. It's kind of impossible to read. Well, we're also very proficient in contractor, contractor ease, contractor ish, something like that. So, yeah, we know generally what guys are trying to say. Even, you know, I'm the worst speller in the world. So, believe me, I understand. Um, but, anyways. Yeah, we provide one-page PCR, one-page damage report, the most comprehensive, straightforward, universal, mind you. Uh, it, it covers pretty much all servicers out there. It makes, you know, we've, we've put all the information in. You know, there's some uh, servicers that had long and extensive PCRs, multiple-page PCRs, many, many pages to fill out, scan, and all that stuff. We got it down to one page. One-page PCR, one-page damage report. Extremely simple. So, yeah, when you're trying to be efficient, you're trying to be accurate, you got to fill out paperwork in the field. It's just that simple. Um, and fortunately for you, you know of somebody that provides this, not only the, number, the, the best quality property preservation data processing services, but they also provide you with some tools. That's right. We provide you with just about everything. Hell, we might as well go out and do the work orders for you. That would be great, wouldn't it? No, it wouldn't. Um, but let's, seriously... Uh, we provide these these forms. These you know, and you're like, why well, this guy's making a vlog about forms? Man, listen, I could do a half hour to an hour about how the 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 pitfalls I've seen with guys that don't fill out forms correctly and what can happen. So yeah, filling out forms in the field is fundamentally a must um, to uh, not only process orders at volume and to for them to be accurate and efficient, but to make sure that everything is just done correctly. It's just that simple. So, unfortunately, we here at the Taylor Shop provide that stuff, and we make sure that, you know, if you guys are having trouble filling them out or there's, you know, some issues, we correct them. And did I mention we keep them updated? Because, listen, if, if there's one thing I know is that clients are constantly asking you more questions and want you to provide more photos and stuff. Well, we make sure we keep updating our form, which gets sent out to you, and then we also update our form on PPW. And I did mention that our form is exclusively on propertypresswizard.com uh, so we make sure and that's it you're not going to find it anywhere else um, never ever ever so that's a somewhat of a shameless plug for PPW but if you're not on PPW what are you a caveman? no I'm kidding uh, so anyways that's all I really had to say this week PCRs fill them out and if you don't not sure about it let us know and we'll help you out it's that simple so, um, yeah, that's about all I can talk to you about PCRs. There's really not much to say. If you have a good one, and we do, and you use it, you're going to do just fine. So that's all I have to say this week. Um, you know, let's get that subscribers up. We need to get them up to 50 so I can start this contest. It's going to be a super easy contest, and you're going to win a lot of goodies. So let's get it up. Uh, share this video. Um, tell your friends. Yeah, I know you know of at least five contractors out there. Tell them to subscribe to this channel. There's a lot of good, valuable information on here. It's going to be coming out every single week. That's the new plan. Every single week, you're going to get a video. You're going to get good, valuable information. So thanks for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, comment if you must, and have yourself a wonderful day.